Becca's Travels. Today I'm going to be doing a travel vlog on budget travel around the world travel vlog. So let's jump right into it. Now originally I was supposed to be this vlog tomorrow but because I've been asked to work at Harrison's and Day. so i'm going to do it today for you um, instead of tomorrow let's jump right into it now according to www.guide.com the following countries um considered friendly or you can do on a budget so let's find out what is South Africa now? It is possible South Africa for safari experience will help encounter uh, encounter a, a breaking bit. Head to dash impal of the excuse me to see the next rhino and so uh, you can also avoid uh, crowds such as Karuna and um, you haven't got the time or the budget to do it and avoid the crowds or um, you can uh, some super lactive hiking drags and, and an amazing few days in one day town it uh, looks at south africa i'm um, on photos um again you can google the places that uh, you uh, want to visit um before you go you can find um budget places to eat and accommodation um other places of interest in india on a uh, trip advice you can uh, you can do this uh, for basically any country or place um to uh, that you want to visit the world so and gives recommendations um of car hire hotels food and where to go at number two on the list is the caribbean island of cuba the soul the dance clubs now that sounds interesting of and to get up in the July carnival festival at San Diego, San Diego or um, dip your toes and um, into Caribbean Bar Beach. Um, again, sounds interesting. You can also get a new tailor made travel service and enjoy a person's plan, uh, plan by a local expert of Cuba. So, wow, that sounds fantastic. If you wanted to do that as well, a big local guide where. Um, Basically, the best places to go and um, what places I need to avoid. Um, so, uh, sorry, three on the list. Um, area, which is a country that I've actually been to, and um, sounds absolutely amazing and fantastic. And again, it is a budget destination. Again, um, 
a really good hotel to Bulgaria. It's absolutely fantastic. It was a four star hotel, and so we didn't actually pay that much for it either. Um, and um, again, local again, food and drink and activities were not that expensive, which is again a big sponsor. Um, Bulgaria is often on overlooked. Um, Bulgaria has a lot to offer for travellers and um, some uh, beaches in Europe and um, it has an appealing coastline there is a lots of lovely objects including on the coast and ancient plough is uh, one of the capitals of culture wow in 2019 so it's absolutely amazing fantastic my back um, to see like Varna and I wouldn't mind to see other sort um, as well and Sophia the capital and Golden um, um, it also has a number of mountain ranges that you can explore um, the mountains and coast by foot or bar um, so yes um, it's a great friendly place if you don't want to again, go to three or four star hotel which you can get um, it cheap especially if you did go out of the season um or it's relatively cheap and you could go at stall see those around or two star hotels and there's um so apartments as well so and um, there's a lot of options again you can Comparison websites set hotel and um, accommodation cheaper, such as Trivago, Booking, um, Pizza, etc. Now, a uh, country number four is basically um, the area, um, which is. Um, Africa's smallest country. It's already known for its beautiful beaches. Um, can also visit Binda to experience delights. Like um, on top of this is the Chimpanzee Centre in the River Gambia National Park. Wow, you can watch primates in their natural habitat so again if you're into animals then um, the, and uh, Africa would be again a great place to visit on a budget um, can See bird life on the bow long wetland reserve and it is most atmospheric at sunset you can basically set a budget in place at Gambia and um, there's lots of uh, fantastic um, Accommodation offers um, at budget prices in we are also uh, 
I go on trips, um, I don't want to expand too far. Um, so, I mean, it's a quite a friendly place um, to go. Number five is um, in the USA and New Orleans. Uh, you can escape from the music at New Orleans with Oscars on every street corner um, or on every corner um, because it's a music city. Um, a music basically in every courtyard or bar. Uh, it's not not hard to see the city's music heritage, and you can also sample city's top sales. At and is also got a wide range of budget places. New Orleans as well, and um, again. Um, in my opinion, with America, it's it, uh, from what I experienced, and um, the flight over there, it, it really passes the mark. And um, the actual food and trip sex, it, that's what I found um, both times uh, to. Orlando and New York and Orlando with a pa package deal or on um, again which again a record and um, also uh, for five days um, to India and to New York and um, we pre-booked a hotel it was equivalent to far, but again, it was yeah, expensive. Uh, to be fair, um, we called the Del Park at the not at the time, but the hotel its name, but in a fabulous hotel. But again, you could get um side side street days. And restaurants in America, but mainly side street cafes or street foods in America but, um, is cheap and you know not that expensive. Um, I think clothes is another cheap thing that um, you can get in America. Um, so again, eating is not uh, again expensive for going up on cruise and basically going for day trips you can even get a cheap accommodation hostel or motel well motel um as a family we sit in Orlando but we sit um international drive and we stayed at days in Lakeside Motel. It's smaller than um, but again, it's you know, a great budget range option, um, and I would imagine there'd be a lot of hostels, hotels, motels, again, Orleans, for you to choose from. Again, you can go on comparison websites and trip advice. So find the deals. Um, also, you can visit uh, local travel agents as well. So, thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe if you haven't already done so. But to get a subscriber, more people watching my channels, and also more viewing my channels. So, again, if you haven't subscribed, subscribe and I'll see you in my next travel. It'll be Sunday and
to be my travel channel updates basically what i'm going to be doing for the following week so again please keep watching love you in the world to me viewers subscribers and see you in my next video bye for now